Dermatology is the scientific study of the skin and is important to barbers because it forms the basis for effective skin and scalp treatment programs. The principal functions of the skin are protection, sensation, heat regulation, excretion, secretion, and absorption. The epidermis is the outermost protective layer of the skin. The dermis is the underlying or inner layer of the skin and is about 25 times thicker than the epidermis. Subcutaneous tissue, also known as adipose tissue, is a layer of fatty tissue found below the dermis. The skin gets its strength, form, and flexibility from protein fibers within the dermis called collagen and elastin. Collagen fibers make up a large portion of the dermis and help to give structural support in this layer. When collagen fibers become weakened, wrinkles and sagging of the skin can occur. Elastin gives the skin its elasticity and flexibility, and the ability to regain its shape after stretching. Blood supply and melanin determine skin color, whether fair or dark. Grains of pigment are deposited in the stratum germinativum of the epidermis and the papillary layer of the dermis. The skin contains two types of duct glands that extract material from the blood to form new substances, the sudoriferous glands or sweat glands and the sebaceous glands or oil glands. Barbers need to recognize lesions such as moles and warts or skin conditions that may be aggravated by facials or shaves. In order to safeguard personal and public health, barbers must not perform services on a client who has an infectious or contagious disorder. There are various visible symptoms of disorders of the skin. Lesions in the form of scales, pimples, or pustules are symptoms that may characterize certain skin conditions. Eczema is an inflammatory skin disease that may be acute or chronic in nature and present in many forms of dry or moist lesions. It is often accompanied by itching or burning. In all cases, should be referred to a physician for treatment. Herpes simplex is a recurring viral infection that produces fever blisters or cold sores and while contagious, rarely lasts more than a week. Psoriasis is a chronic inflammatory skin disease characterized by dry red patches covered with coarse silvery scales. Acne is characterized by chronic inflammation of the sebaceous glands from retained secretions. Although the cause of acne is generally held to be microbic in nature, factors such as adolescence and disturbances of the digestive tract can trigger inflammations. The two basic types of acne are acne simplex, or common pimples, and acne vulgaris, which is a more serious and deep-seated skin condition. It is always advisable for the client with an acne condition to seek diagnosis and treatment by a competent physician before receiving any facial service. A comedone or blackhead is a mass of hardened sebum in a hair follicle and should only be removed by using proper extraction procedures. Milia, also known as whiteheads, are small, whitish masses of sebum in the epidermis and are often associated with dry skin types. Seborrhea is a skin condition due to overactivity and excessive secretion of the sebaceous glands. An oily or shiny nose, forehead, or scalp with possible itching or burning sensations indicates the presence of seborrhea. On the scalp, it is readily detected by the presence of an unusual amount of oil on the hair. A steatoma is a sebaceous cyst or fatty tumor that is filled with sebum. A steatoma usually occurs on the scalp, neck, or back and is sometimes called a wen.